Hello, I'm Sean Fitzgerald, Marketing Manager at Safe Tech of America, Inc. In this video, we will show you how our popular Universal Precautions Kit can help you comply with OSHA standards. You'll also hear from Chip Obie, a sales specialist here at Safe Tech of America, on the five steps to properly contain and remove a spill. There are five steps to effectively contain and remove a bloodborne pathogen spill with SafeTech's Universal Precaution Kit. The steps are to prevent, contain, and remove, disinfect, dispose, and sanitize. Prevent. To prevent direct contact with spill during the cleanup process and minimize the risk for infection, disposal protection clothing must be worn. This includes gloves, combo mask safety shield, and protective apron. Contain and remove. To effectively contain and remove the spill, a solidifying agent like Red Z and scoop and scraper are to be used and the spill contents are to be disposed of in a red biohazard bag. Disinfect. To properly disinfect, the contaminated surface area, use the sanitized germicidal wipe. This process is critical for preventing any further contamination. Dispose. Discard the germicidal wipe, gloves, and safety shield and apron into a red biohazard bag and dispose of bag as required by your local, state, and federal regulations. Sanitize. Use the pause wipe to sanitize hands and use soap and water after cleanup is done. Those were the five steps of the Universal Precaution Kit. The kit is designed to help in OSHA standard compliance. To learn more about this or any of our other products, please visit us at www.safetech.com.